Hello, I am Dr. David Burns. I'm a professor emeritus at the University of California, San Diego School of Medicine. Cigarette smoking is one of the major causes of heart attacks in the United States. About a third of the heart attacks that occur in the United States are caused by cigarette smoking. A heart attack occurs when the blood vessels delivering blood and oxygen to the heart muscle become blocked. What then happens is the muscle that is dependent on that oxygen and blood delivery dies and you get a scar in the heart and the heart then doesn't work as effectively because it has lost some of the muscle tissue uh, that it requires in order to pump and to spread blood to the rest of your body. Cigarette smoking causes heart attacks in two principal ways. It increases the buildup of plaque of the uh, fibro fatty uh, bulging of the walls of the artery and that narrows then the artery leading to the heart. At a second, the second effect of cigarette smoking is that it increases the likelihood that a given part of the um, uh, artery will clot or will block off uh, or will become ischemic and cause the muscle behind it uh, to then go on to die. So there are two principal effects. We know that cigarette smoking, uh, even secondhand smoke exposure, alters what we call the endothelial function of the blood vessels. That's the function of the inside of the tubes that you provide blood to the rest of the body. Uh, that abnormal function increases the likelihood of both formation of atherosclerosis, formation of these fatty fibrous plaques uh, in the walls of the artery, and also increases the likelihood that those arteries are going to clot.